okay Ian, so it's been uh, quite an eventful summer for you, starting off with the Lions Tour, how was that experience? Yeah it was good, it was a great experience to get away across the other side of the world playing rugby in New Zealand, met a lot of new uh, new people, new faces and, and kept in touch with a good few of them and it was a really great experience on and off the field. And then shortly after you returned home from New Zealand there was another fairly significant event. Yeah, yeah, married uh, just after a few days after I came back so uh, the stress didn't end in New Zealand, came back straight into the mixer, got wet up and then and then off and I had a nice couple of relaxing weeks on honeymoon and then after that another week off at home and then straight into pre-season. So how was it for you then coming back in readjusting after the all the events of the summer and uh, getting back into the routine of pre-season? Yeah it was good, it was, like, it was good to get back in doing bits and pieces and um, the boys have been in for a while before we returned. It was kind of good to get back into the swing of things, meet the new coaches, kind of get into the sort of daily routine of training and and pre-season was tough enough, but then after the first couple of weeks, you get sort of used to it again. And the biggest cheer of the evening we're about to get, and indeed are getting, it goes on for his first appearance since he toured with the British and Irish Lions in New Zealand earlier on this summer is uh, Ian Henderson. He made a return on Friday night. Uh, how was it getting back out there? Yeah, it was great. Uh, another, another good win, I think. Yeah. Love playing here, love playing in front of the home crowd. It was uh, great to come out to the number of fans that were, came out to support us and it turned out to be quite a nice evening for it. Coaches were happy enough, but there's plenty of work-ons uh, for for my personal game and for, for everyone else on the pitch. I'm sure we'll have things pointed out to them that they've got to get right um, and we've just got to keep on building week on week and trying to improve our team performance as a whole. Um, but again, it was great to get the win and the bonus point too. But however, this week will probably be um, slightly tougher. It'll be a, a difficult time for us, I think, over in Italy um, after their big win last week. Four wins from four games then for the boys. Uh, how have things been shaping up from what you've been watching? Yeah, look, I think there's definitely been positives in a lot of those games. But a few of the games we've probably slipped up and not um, performed as well as we'd have liked to. However... I think maybe last season we went 4-4 four from four at the start of the season. We just got to make sure that we can stay on top of our own game and continue to improve. Whereas last season we might have dropped off a bit. We just need to come on working um, on things that need improving and, and trying to learn from what we don't do right each week and, and just bettering ourselves. And I'm sure you've been keeping a close eye on that second row, back row area. A lot of guys sticking their hands up there for places. Yeah, look, it's fantastic. Loads of competition in there. Um, the back row, obviously doing so well, so many big ball carriers, getting this good quick back, uh, quick ball so that the backs can um, play some rugby and in the second row as well. Robbie D's been playing well, so is Al and, and Treader's coming back into the mix. So like, competition's really high, which is good, it's what we want and it, and it just means training, starting to get more feisty and better and better competition um, will hopefully breed success. You mentioned then next up is a way trip to Zebra this weekend. What's the focus been for the team looking to add to that? Yeah, I think we've got to make sure that we do our own jobs right and don't work, don't get um, carried away by what they do too much. Make sure that what we do, um, we do well. And make sure that we can perform the way we know that we can perform and um, not get too distracted by what they do.